Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. We are going to be doing some expansion today. Specifically, we are expanding our uh, iron sheets and our copper sheets. Iron plates and copper sheets. Tonight, we are drinking a new drink. It's called a plasma splitter. Wait, no, plasma spitter, <laughs> not a splitter. Plasma spitter. It's tequila, melon, oh my god, tongue twister. Tequila, melon liqueur, triple sec blue curacao, and it's topped with soda water and a little lime wheel garnish. Cheers. Tastes like blue curacao. That's sort of the problem with blue curacao. Such a strong flavor, even though it's such a small component of the recipe. Also, the picture of this drink is way greener. This is very blue. The picture in the recipe I got was a much greener looking drink, so... I think maybe my uh, melon liqueur was not as green as the one the, uh, the recipe maker was using, but... Anyhow, it tastes okay. Not amazing, but not horrible. So, I believe these are our sheets here. So we're going to double up these sheets. That is sort of a plan. And we're going to stick a wall in here. Oops, and fall off the edge apparently. Actually, yeah, no, that, that works. Okay. So zoot me across. We need to get rid of all of this. All our fancy decoration needs to go away. Okay, and let's make this regular old boring fix-it foundations. So, we're going to expand iron plates, we're going to expand copper sheets, and if we have time, we're also going to expand these steel pipes. If we can do all of that this episode, that would be awesome, because I would really like to get our aluminum production up and running so I'm hoping to start that very soon hopefully next episode depending on how quickly we're able to do all this okay let's get our constructors in here we're gonna need some power in here Whoa, don't do that. That's too bad this isn't a double. Let's just do this. This will be easier. Uh, sure, that's fine. No, just, just build normally, please. Okay. Let's not fall off. Okay. Actually, let's figure out how we're gonna get this copper up here. So our copper belts end here. Or if we just like loop them around, bring them up, and then I think we're gonna do that. Okay. Uh, I believe I actually have blueprints for this left input so I want right input and let's start at this far wall make sure we got space for all this and you should probably be there okay and we're going to do the same thing as downstairs we need eight of these Okay. Oh my, this is not going to work at all. I thought for some reason this was five wide, and it's definitely not. Okay. That is unfortunate. We need to have these right up against the wall. 
This room is only four tiles wide. Okay. That's fine. We can do that. Let's make sure this is lined up correctly. Yes. There we go. Two, three, and four. Yes. Okay. So knowing you don't want to line up. Uh, let's put a merger in here first then before we get too far. Let's see, that might work. Uh, no, we need left input. So once I get this first one lined up, we should be good. Okay. That is indeed lined up. It is indeed. So I would like three more of these. Then we'll get some belts running. figure out how many copper sheets these are making because I don't know what size belts I need. I feel like they're 20. You make 20 a minute, don't you? 10. Cool. Oh, actually, in order to support production for these, we are going to need to increase our uh, copper smelting as well, which I think is just a case of upgrading the belts because I'm pretty sure... I've already got the smelters made. Oh, I just went backwards. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the copper, or foundries. It's foundries, smelters? I think they're smelters. The smelters are there. They seem to be belted up and then we'll be good. Okay. Actually, you know what we should do? I wonder if this will work. Give me a merger. Could you merge onto here? It looks like you can. Okay, this could work. This has potential. The only trick is, is getting these copper belts up here now. Maybe we start, uh, well, maybe, let's see. Okay, I, that's the direction I want. Ooh. It does not line up particularly well. It's kind of going through the floor. Is there a way I could not have that kind of going through the floor? Yeah. Just like that. Okay. Same thing over here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now we have to do this because 
a bunch of copper plates are being used in our electronic shop. We are definitely going to have a shortage if we don't increase this. And a shortage of copper plates means a bunch of other things aren't going to be running either. So we definitely don't want that. Uh, I did these Mark III. Let's just keep them Mark III. Can, oops, I'm pressing the wrong button. Okay. There we go. Let me up. Cool, that should be good. Let's get these things wired up and then our copper plate should be in a good spot. Should be. And you go over there. Uh, I'm not doing this right. Let's try that one again. Okay, so after this, I, we'll go work on the copper smelting. I don't actually think we have enough iron production right now to boost up our iron plates, so I might just not worry about it. Why aren't you on? Oh, right, it'd probably help if I actually hook <laughs> these belts up. Still doesn't explain why that one's not on, though. Hello? Did none of these settings pay, though? Copper sheets, what's the problem? Did I like copy and paste an empty one or something? Huh, weird, I don't know why that happened. Yeah, I don't know how I managed that. I'm sure it's in the archival footage somewhere. Me copying and pasting the wrong machine or something is probably what happened. Okay, right, there we go. Copper is done. Celebratory drink. All right. Uh, yeah, so you can see we're already running out of ingots, but that's fine. Um, what we would also like to do is go up here. We'll throw our roof on here too while we're here. It should be pretty quick. Very nice. That is obviously not correct. Okay. Come on, go up. Uh, this probably also means I need to probably slug out the old miner as well, at least a little bit. Oh no, you're not gonna fit nicely, are you? Could you go flat? How do I make you go flat? No. Do I need a foundation? Maybe I need a foundation. Hmm. Very interesting. If I zoop you up. Yeah. Oops. Eh, whatever. <laughs> That's fine. Come on. 
You know you want to come this way. No, you want to come this way. Because it does not want to come this way. Super annoying. Okay. All right. Good. This is good. Let's get some more copper ingots. Um, we'll start by hooking up the rest of these foundries. Actually, we should be starting by improving those belts. We can come back and do that. Okay, what's up here? I actually need to count how many of these things I have. I'm not even sure. I feel like I built them for a 480 build. So we've got 4, 8, 12. Uh, 12 at 30. Oh, it's only 360. Excuse me, 360. So I could actually... Uh, Make this building a little bit longer if I needed to. Which I don't really want to do, to be perfectly honest. Let's dump some of this in here. a lot more in case beams so let's go grab a couple stacks there's some in here either are there's also a lot of sheets in here what else is in here concrete yeah, I'll take some more concrete sure take some of these this is all left over from me building our uh, power plant area there we go Okay, we're getting through all that. How much for motors, actually? Sure. All right. Oh, no. What did I do there? Let's go fix that real quick. Actually, we can work backwards from this room. Oh, yeah, that is clearly not correct. All right. Okay, so let's work backwards. From here. So you are gonna to need to be Mark Four. Now the question is, how do I get down there? Get down to my hellscape tunnels here. I believe there's a door in here somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Climb that? There we go. Okay, something's still holding it up. What is holding it up? You're all sixes. Mark four. You're all mark four. That's mark four. No, why? Oh, this little, <laughs> this little thing right here. Okay, cool. There we go. So, let's just go get our actual iron or copper boosted up here. So, I said we had 360, I think. Let's make sure we have 360 coming out. Coming out of Yon Miner over here. 
It looks like it's a Mark II already, so that's that's a plus. How are we doing? Perfect. Well, that was an easy upgrade to our copper, at least. Get that. Ugh, I really hate this belt system I've got here. Maybe I'll fix it one day. Not today, though. Also, is there no way into this building from this side? Does not look like it. Interesting. Nope, won't do that. Okay, what's next? How are we doing for time? Nine minutes. I don't think we have the iron production to double up our, or add another layer onto our iron plates, unfortunately. So maybe we go do steel pipe. Or alternatively, maybe we just don't do any of that stuff. <laughs> I don't know what the answer is. Let's go see. The reason we need more steel pipe, or, um, well, we need more steel pipe as well. The reason we need more plates is for this. Because I want more, I want to turn these on. And I can't, because we don't have the plates being made. Ugh, you know what? I'm not going to do this right now, because um, the plates require a whole other belt here to be run, and it has to be run all the way to the other building, because I believe I hijacked the belt I had put in there temporarily for something else. So you know what? We're not going to do that. I'll hook these up for literally no reason, and we'll call it a day. Okay, cool. Let's go slap another layer of iron or steel pipes on, or at least start getting another layer of steel pipes put in here. To our steel pipe tower. <laughs> How do we get in there? Have I built a way to get upstairs? That is not this. No. Okay, so I am going to have to... Put a hyper tube in or something. First off, let's delete all of this. Oh, actually, you know what? You do not need to be deleted. Don't think you do either. Okay. Nope, you keep going. I'm so scared I'm going to go over and like delete the roof or something or like a belt or power line would not be the first time that's happened. Okay. Give me some walls. 
How tall are these rooms? Three. And I believe there's four constructors in each. I know this isn't necessary, but I'm here now. I'm going to do it. And literally, I'm just going to build the exact same roof that I had on the first one. Okay. Also, while we're up here. weird huh yeah I was like spinning when I hit the snap button I don't know why I was doing that okay cool I actually did build it the right direction which is a plus to do some fancy mergers on top of these lifts I think in order to get our get our steel up here and to get our pipes down although <laughs> there is a lift right there it looks like it's pretty good to go why don't we just do that uh yeah I mean, that seems to make sense. Maybe stick it right here. Maybe like this, so the belt's not overlapping. Yeah. Let's do it like that. It might be a little bit in the way of our uh, output line, but we can figure that out later. Okay. So this should help our heavy frame manufacturing because I believe that's what was holding up that. Now, let's make sure we don't connect this to here because I really want to based on where this is positioned. That would be a bad thing. Actually, I don't even think we can. I think this is an output. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, we're going to make a small change here. Where are you coming off of that? Okay. You're going to go there. I can go there. Oh, did I screw this up already? I think I did. Let's try this again. Yeah, I want this like this. Oh, maybe I don't. Let's see. Um, your merger. How badly overlapping are you if I put you on here? Kind of badly. 
But not really badly enough that I'm too worried about it. So let's just not worry about it. And it's not super hot either, but it's done. <laughs> so, again, not worrying about it. Okay. Well, that was pretty easy. Another pretty quick upgrade to things. Can't really argue with that. Now we do have a hold up down here somewhere. Really? Two, four, six. Oh, they're gonna have 160. Okay. Well, time to get upgraded, I guess. And again, we're gonna have to trace this. No, oh, I guess we're not tracing it too far. Okay, 816 to 432. Yeah, actually, we do need to trace it farther because this has to be a level or a mark four now. Which is good because it means we're producing lots of. Or there's a split here too. Well, that's convenient. There we go. Perfect. Let's go slap a roof on here and call it an episode. I don't. Do you go outside? No, you don't. We'll just close that back up. There's seriously no door outside here, eh? Let's put a door here. Actually, let's put a door here. I got another plan for this spot. I'm going to run these hyper tubes and then we will call it an episode. But I'd like it to be run. Yeah, that'd be fine. Oh, there's a door there. I see. Okay. You know what? Let's do it like this. Hyper tube wall hole. My corner's a safe spot, right? No, it is not. You know what? Let's not worry about it. We can do some outside hyper tubes if we need. Oh, I didn't realize those were so far off. Let's fix that. We'll worry about hypertubes another day. We're not up here this often. Okay, now there's no floor in here, so let's remember that. Nice. not like this like this or do I maybe I do Okay. Actually, maybe before we end the episode, we'll run over and take a quick look at our heavy frames manufacturer and see if it's actually manufacturing. Sure. It's beautiful. Um, is there any plastic left in any of these by any chance? No.
Oh, I was running around with the gun at the end of the last episode. It's pretty freaking sweet, man. Really, really wish I'd built it a lot sooner. Well, it's running. That's a good sign. Oh, yeah, look at all the pipes now. Heck yeah. Okay, cool. That is a very good sign. I'm actually going to... Nah, no, I'm not going to sell your pipes. You can keep your pipes. But what I am going to do is put in a cut here. This seems like a pretty good spot. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. We will see you next time. Cheers.